What's happening guys? I'm here to update you on my seed saga as I uh, have called it in my first video and of course we have here we have the I believe it's black seeded Simpson lettuce purple tomatillo here habanero pepper serrano pepper and the first to germinate I didn't keep you up to date entirely was uh, not that long ago I think January 21st was when I actually put these in but this was the first to germinate maybe five days later, then followed a couple of days after by the purple tomatillo. And then, honestly, I checked these yesterday, and all the peppers that have come up came up, you know, uh, overnight. So it uh, didn't take too long. And that's, that's amazing for the habanero. Normally, they take a little longer to germinate. But if you look closely, and I'm not sure you can actually see it on here. I have a, I have a light to help me out. I don't know... If that'll help illuminate it at all or not but if you can see right in this area let's uh let's actually disconnect here for a second i don't know if you can see that but towards the center there the soil's kind of greenish let's take the light away i don't know if that's any better but the soil's kind of greenish that is a fungus there's a little on this side as well that's a fungus of some sort, and I'm not sure exactly what it is, but it is no good that it's growing on this thing here. So we're going to nip it in the bud. We're not going to use any chemicals. We're not going to use any anything harsh, anything that's going to be dangerous to, to anyone, not just us or uh, plants and, and uh, the people we love or whatever. But the easy solution for this, bam. Can you see that? Ground cinnamon, 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 cinnamon. Okay, yeah, but ground cinnamon, it is naturally an antifungal, so it will work on this. It helps for dampening off is what, I don't think this is dampening off. I believe that's typically white, but, you know, correct me if I'm wrong, pretty please. But if it is dampening off, basically what happens is seed germinates, you have a tiny little seedling. This stuff basically cuts the plant down, kills it, so you'll have to... I have to start all over again, and I'm not trying to start all over again, because I had to start all over with another set of uh, four things that I was growing. So, basically, simple treatment here is we sprinkle. You don't especially want to get any on the leaves. I don't think it's going to be especially harmful if you do. It's not end of the world material. But basically, that's it. I'm going to just sprinkle some more. It's not coming out so well. So I'm afraid it's just going to dump out all at once, because that's how it do. But this should help with the dampening off, should make it less of an issue, should uh, help keep the plants a little healthier. And, you know, it's not perfect. But so far, it's worked on all the others. i just give it a little, little bit of a, a man breeze there to try and clear some of this off. But these have actually been downstairs for two days now. I have a, a little area upstairs with a grow light that I've been germinating and starting seeds, but this... This has been down for two days now, so you'll see some of them are like that lettuce and the tomatillos not looking so happy. But that's just they haven't had light in a couple of days. And I, was, I just didn't have time over the last 24 hours to, to make this video, but now I do. So now I did, and there it is, and you guys have it. So thanks for watching, and I'll keep you updated next time something comes along. Hopefully no more issues. Hopefully just happy news rolling forward. All right, guys. Take care.